Encore uh, F-102 Delta Dagger kit that I bought a few years ago. Squadron was offering the uh, Encore kits, which um, I learned are actually uh, repops of the Monogram 48 scale kits from the way back when. Yeah. Yep. So they've got all the raised panel lines and oh, stuff nice. like that. Those are fun. That's a so, feature. Yeah, sure. Um, but uh, the kit's actually a really nice kit. Great detail on the landing gear. Um, great deal, or detail rather, in the uh, um, cockpit assembly. And um, I've, I was uh, impressed with the quality of the kit itself. Um, and then um, Squadron made it a better deal because they uh, decided to pop some uh, resin um, upgrades for the kit, which uh, hadn't really been done before. So you get a resin cockpit and some uh, uh, wheels and stuff like that, and you get a nice batch of the um, Falcon. Uh, yeah, Falcon missiles that uh, if you're going to do the um, weapons bays open, uh, they've got the uh, rails, drop down rails that you can put in there and put the missiles on the rails. So I thought that was pretty cool. And then they provide you with um, photo etch, uh, photo etch um, uh, instrument panel and side console and a um, couple of photo etch pieces to dress up the uh, exhaust and some um, canopy um, uh, canopy rails. Is it canopy or is it belt? That's the canopy rails? I'm pretty sure that's canopy okay. rails. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and then... Um, that's pretty nice. Yeah, so it was, uh, it was a, kind of a nice surprise to open it up. And I bought it just because I had a... I've got the old Monogram 106 that I'm going to build. And uh, I thought... Yeah, I had plans for that because the um, 318th Fighter Interceptor Squadron out of uh, McCord flew the 106s. Right. And I've got the Caracal decal set for the um, 318th 106s. Mm -hmm. And I don't know, you guys, some of you have seen the F4, uh, F-15A yep. from the 318th yeah. that I built and the T-33A from the 318th that I built, which was an academy kit. And uh, I'm trying to build a collection of all of the 318th birds. Um, so I happened to see uh, about a month ago um, from uh, Armor, is it Armor Scale? Up in uh, Canada. Uh, that uh, Armorcast that sells a um, um, bunch of accessories and stuff like that. And they offered the uh, decal sheet for the 318th 102. Oh, nice. So I scored that. Um, that's uh, the old 318th uh, uh, fin, um, uh, fin tail flash, marking, tail yeah. markings. Fin disc, yeah. Yeah. And... Um, so I was excited to see that. Now I'm actually excited about building oh, the kit. That's the old yeah. one. Yeah. Interim one. Yeah. So I may be wrong, but I think the McCord Museum has a 102. They do. 102 and a 106. And a 106? Yeah. I think so. <clears throat> They're both over there. Yeah. It's been a lot of years since I saw. They've also got a 101. Yep. 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 So was so. a Falcon? Was that radar guided? I can't. Yeah. It's what a was, was it? They were what, aim fours. Aim fours. They had oh, a bad yeah. reputation. Yeah. Though. Yeah. Because, you know, flying in Vietnam, I'm sure they carried the Falcon. Well, that was the only air-to-air -air weapon that the, they, the 102s could carry yeah, because they, they were, no originally yeah. they were set up to fly with uh, Genies, which were atomic bomb, uh, atomic missiles. Mm -hmm. right. 